Hey, I'm Novelineal, uh, doing some test plays today, uh, so I'm going to be running your map here, Erin House. Sorry, I'm probably saying that incorrectly. Um, okay, let me grab my notes here. Okay, first map, uh, very cool. Hope you're having fun. Uh, but yeah, otherwise, kind of nothing specific, so just sort of like general feedback and stuff. Uh, so yeah, this should be fine. Um, yeah, so th they'll... Like, I ran it through the map checker. We'll talk more about it in a second. It, it did flag a bunch of issues and stuff. Um, uh, no jump speed looks good. I think this is expert plus. Yeah, so that should be good. That jump distance is a little high. Uh, puts reaction time at about 7... 75. Uh, so that's really high. I'll probably have to pull that in because uh, I think you want it to have... Um, quite a bit shorter for uh, Expert Plus, but like, let, I'll see how it plays and I'll just kind of pull it in if I have to. Uh, so starting now. Um, yeah, but we'll just kind of see. There might have been some vision blocks there. Sorry, that was me. So there's nothing wrong with these single saber sections. They they might be a little fast. Ooh, I think um, yeah, the map checker flagged a couple of invalid obstacles. Um, we'll talk more about that in a second, but. sets there. I'll have to go back so quite a minute. Hopefully I remember to go back. Oh, sorry. That was just, that was just me. I, I got distracted by the walls there because I think, uh, I think those walls aren't properly set up. You'll have to ask in the chat because it did get flagged for invalid obstacles. Uh, and the problem is, um, I'm, I'm not a hundred percent sure on that. Okay. That part was fine. It might've been a reset on red. Uh, I think that was a reset on red. Yeah, that was a reset on blue. Whoa. I might have to play that part slower. That could have just been a me thing. This is just not my strength doing those kind of things. So that could have just been me. A uh, reset on blue, I think. Reset on red. Uh, some vision blocks there. But otherwise, I like that pattern. Yeah, and, and as I kind of said before, some of those single saber sections... Um, sorry, I, I was looking at my clock. Some of those single saber sections are maybe a, a little bit fast, but I don't think that's a big deal. I mean, it's expert plus. Okay, so there were two parts. So oh God, I already forget. Uh, okay, yeah, so that was definitely... Uh, a reset there and and like that's not a good reset right because i think you had two up notes on red in quick succession um so that that's gonna be basically unplayable yeah so so yeah uh yeah so that's a bad one um because some of the other resets like you could probably get away with because like the speed of the map but with how fast those ones were um that that one's definitely going to be a problem I mean, that, I think that was the worst reset, other than that. Yeah, 
also, again, I think that was a reset on Droid, but, like, that one wasn't egregious. And, like, see, same thing there. Like, there was a reset on that red, but, like, all things equal, like, they're kind of pretty playable. Okay, so this could just be me, but, because I, I will say I'm not good at things like this, but... Uh, let's try there. I think uh, this is a minor thing, but like you're kind of hanging out over here. I think I would have liked to see like a little bit flow over to the other side. But like, that's a minor thing. So I'm really focusing. <laughs> I, I like I can play stuff like that, but I really have to think about it. <laughs> See, then I messed that one up, too. So that could just be me. Okay. Yeah, so I think that was fine. I think the last red note up here to the side was a little bit weird after that, like, kind of rapid thing. Um, so I think that's fine. I mean, if anything because like other than that one uh double directional that i pointed out earlier like those those rapid bits at the end i think we're fine um it it might be considered a little bit of a difficulty spike compared to the rest of the map because you don't really have anything that's kind of at that speed right um if you want to again this is just a me thing but if you want to one way you can make sections like that a little bit more friendly is not having the rapid notes uh in line with each other like if you have it more sway side by side like kind like you did earlier but it doesn't even have to be like that dramatic right because i don't think for those parts you want that full side to side sway but for example like you could have like the two red notes alternating between these two lanes here and the two blue notes alternating between these two lanes here i mean it, i think it actually the blue ones kind of did it was it was only the red ones um on that last one and of course the blue ones on the iteration before that so again like the 100 percent that is not required right like that's just, I struggle to see inline notes. So 100% take it with a grain of salt. If you like it, it is totally fine as is. It's just, I found it a little bit of a difficulty spike compared to the rest of the map. Um, but the, all that said, like for a first map, that's really good. Like this is a good attempt for a first map. Um, a lot of the patterns were really cool. And, and other than just kind of watching out for sort of some rookie mistakes, like the resets and the vision blocks, like... It's a cool map, like, because, I mean, I doing test plays, I, I play a lot of first time mappers and typically like they're going to be like bottom row only using only the center notes. Uh, you don't do that. You're all over the place. You've got a lot of cool doubles going on here. Um, uh, yeah, a lot of really cool ideas. I think the timing was good on everything. At least I didn't notice anything. Uh, like I said, I would maybe just bring in the jump distance a little bit bit like yeah so like a few things to work on but that's a really good first attempt uh so uh like i think once you polish it off here it was a it's, it's a really good representation for the music the doubles felt interesting um i don't think anything felt super repetitive because you see that a lot in beginner maps as well uh not to say you can't mirror anything or repeat anything but i never really felt like it was um overly repetitive uh so yeah well done um polish up a few things and and i think you're gonna have a really good map here so uh yeah ask me if you have any questions uh but otherwise i hope that helps